Alright guys, so what's up though, but I thought today get a really quick Pokemon video I want to do that really quick. Of course we got two new episodes to review, um, Go, Go Collecting Flygon, of course I forgot to review that episode, and I also did forget to, um, review, not review, review the Lola one, because I actually back in that Lola and stuff like that, just, you know, it's like a one episode thing, they tend to do this type of thing a lot. Yeah, but of course though, um, yeah, again, I'm not going to be these videos that long anyway, again, episode reviews don't really need to be that long, I meant to, again, to make this separate and stuff like that, because, I don't know, I tend to record the where I review, like, one episode, but I kind of stalled out a little bit in the beginning. Um, that's how I've been structured and stuff like that, so of course, yeah, like I said before, um, again, because I got other stuff I want to do today, I was like, you know what, I'll get this Pokemon, Pokemon one out of the way first today. Um, I know I got a video, video for, um, I think it's recording, um, for me specifically right now, because I don't know when I'm going to upload this video. I have, my, I have all my other Pokemon videos ready, because I don't know when I'm going to upload them. I'm going to upload them all in order, of course, if I am. Maybe next couple of days I might start doing it, I don't know. But yeah, um, again, I'll probably record this, like, months apart and stuff like that, of course. So yeah, again, I don't know when I'm going to upload, I don't know upload these videos. I'm going to try my best to do it, though, of course, you know, because a lot of things keep coming out lately. But of course, though, let's get started. So yeah, of course, the first episode, we'll go catch a Flygon. Um, it's pretty simple, so like, yeah, it catches, like, all the evolutionary forms. Uh, at first, I think it's, like, Turpinch, then it goes up to Flygon and stuff like that, of course. I cannot remember as, um, second evolution for life for me, though, so yeah. Um, no, I'll say Flygor. I'm thinking something else. But yeah, of course, though, I'm not going to try to make these that long. I'm going to try to make them short as I can, though, of course, because, you know, I got other stuff I want to do today. So, yeah, let's get started. Of course, but yeah, the first episode kind of starts out this right after, like, I had Val's B and stuff like that, of course. Um, you know, I'm actually going, you know, tripping, doing a typical thing. I'm about to go, you know, do the Pokemon thing, of course. Then Ash gets challenged, of course. Then he has, um, you know, flashbacks from Octillery to, you know, um, <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, yeah, start another blue Pokemon that I got him beat. But yeah, of course, they start the battle and stuff like that. And of course, he gets decimated, like typical Ash thing. And his red kind of gets messed up as well. So yeah, he really gets demolished. And of course, you know, Ash is like, oh yeah, dang, just dang. Then he's like, okay, I'm gonna try harder. Yeah, typical Ash can be fired up. Then, of course, you know, he tried to battle again. I mean, he'll get his spares up and stuff like that. Then, of course, you know, gets beat by another tentacle monster. Yeah, typical anime things. Then Ash gets beat again. Um, then, like, just poor Ash, you know, he goes just like, man, poor Ash. Then, in the outskirts of the city, you know, the Jack is just kind of comes out of nowhere. But, um, but then he can get reported back to the lab and stuff like that, so yeah, of course, you know, he goes, you know, interested in doing his thing and stuff like that, and Ash is just super depressed. He really goes into depression. <laughs> poor Ash, but yeah. Of course, he went down, you know, losing and stuff like that. Of course, maybe he goes like, okay, maybe just trim up. Then, it's like, yeah, let's just, you know, <laughs> I didn't see this before. Yeah, Ash is just getting a little under. Um, depressish, depressish. Depression. I said depression. I said depression. -ish. Whatever. Uh, please don't. Please don't. Please. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, like I said though, then of course, you know, um, <laughs> Yeah, then, then, you know, we got the Goggle Squad, squad, um, I got a little bit of right there, of course. But yeah, then, then, of course, you know, I should go, you know, doing the typical thing again, going down, um, you know, into the storm and stuff like that, the eye of the storm. Yeah, they got the goggles covered and stuff like that, of course. And then, because, you know, it was a Pokemon, oh, yeah, oh, dang, a lot of people got stuck in the storm. Um, then after this, yeah, they found, like, there's, like, a Turpinch and stuff like that, because, you know, go doing a simple thing, could have catch it, and he caught it, you know, fresh eye and stuff like that, pretty good, though. He probably got it off guard, and, of course, you know, get the folks out of there and stuff like that, you know. Then they tried to go, um, discover more of the, um, you know, a five guys about evolution and stuff like that. Then goes like, you know what? Gonna go catch it anyway, again. So, yeah. Um, again, he's like, hey, I'm gonna catch it again. So, typical stuff like that, of course. Um, yeah, then, uh, you know, the big boy himself comes out, the boy, you know, the next person for Ghost Team and stuff like that. Um, Flygon and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, of course, comes out again, though, while, you know, all, all the evolutionary stuff. Typical stuff, like, like I said that before, of course. Um, I don't know why I'm sweating. Um, Give me like one second. I don't know why I'm sweating so much. But yeah. Um. Again, though, that that you know, um. To go, yeah, Ghost was trying to catch it and stuff like that. You know, the Ash was trying to bow and stuff like that. I guess. Um. You know, still in the fuck stuff like that. You know, from losing. Uh, this typical Ash thing. You know, it happens like with after the gym battles and stuff like that. He kind of reflects and goes over and stuff like that. Blah blah blah. Typical Ash stuff. That's all. That's how yeah, like you know, kind of goes like it's just losing the fuck and stuff like that. It's typical stuff. Yeah, that's all. Comes in for the clutch and stuff like that. Then they they get just defeated. Um, yeah. Yeah, actually go, um, you know, go try to, um, catch, um, fly go and try to get off guard or something like that. Um, by using vacuum weave, of course, you know, Subble gets, you know, kind of, I, I think he gets confused, or messes, um, yeah, so he gets confused and stuff like that, and of course, Ash, you know, um, 
They didn't um, go across the back. They had their ass, you know, kind of, you know, just fucking with the power and stuff like that. You know, again, that stuff, you know, doing his pot and stuff like that. He doesn't know what to do. Um, then, of course, you know, Go has like, like, come back up in reality. Typical Ash thing. Again, this always happens for him and stuff like that. Um, goes like, oh, Ash, like, oh, you got a plan. He's like, eh, I'll just go ahead and do what I want. Um, you know, learning from his experiences and stuff like that. Of course, you know, as you know, he's watching, been watching Ash and you know, going on a journey and stuff like that. Of course, good cousin keep learning from each other and stuff like that. You know, learn from Score Bunny. Um, I'm the Rabbit, of course, you know, they're going to start, um, you know, connecting, bonding, and stuff like that, but of course, um, you know, Ash kind of realizes it and stuff like that, you know, kind of opens his eyes and stuff like that, of course. The flow, um, flow, go catch his flag on, that's cool. Um, but, you know, getting added to the team, we've seen the intro already, so yeah, we pretty much seeing him got hair across, flag on, again, Pokemon do his openings and stuff like this, kind of, they tend to kind of do like do it like this, where they're basically, you know, um, having the opening and stuff like that, get, yeah, because we already, I like the opening already passed, but we have pretty much already got everything already confirmed from the opening-ish, yeah. Even stuff like even before opening happened, so look, I think we were there before the opening even happened. Second opening, I did do a video and I have that video ready to go. I think I have my Pokemon videos ready to go because when I was off, when I was off the internet for a couple of days, I got some videos done, so it's pretty good though. Of course, you know, look up call for Ash, a big wake up call, and stuff like that, you know. Um, you know, last stuff like that, of course, you know. Um, him, you know, you know, basically Ash had to do like do his own thing and stuff like that, of course, you know, a typical Ash thing, you know. Him to you know, trying to focus on um, all this stuff, then you know, realizes you know, Pokemon stuff like that. Pokemon Spear, woo. Then again, that, that episode ends, you know, going Ash, you know, courage, you know, go Ash gets back his confidence, go catch Flygon and stuff like that. Of course, goes confidence boosts up, and Ash, of course, you know, is gonna keep getting stronger. And of course, I think after the Lola episode, we're gonna see, I think, not after the, I think then after the Lola one, um, after the um, next one after that, I think it's gonna be after the B again. I will do the rematch video for that. I know the time's recording for the US, we're all supposed to be getting the um. It, for the U.S. I can't remember what it was for U.S. It was a um, Korean vs. Ash episode that should be coming up next. Maybe because, again, they're going to try to do it, I think, every month or every couple of months. They're going to try to release episodes and make batches and stuff like that. So, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, pretty good. But, yeah, of course, um, that was the episode. I did like that episode. That was pretty good. You know, Ash, you know, kind of losing, you know, and stuff like that. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me, though, there. You know, give this confident back. Typical stuff for Ash. It's always been like that for, like, the longest time. Again, you know, this typical Ash thing, you know, always happens for him and stuff like that. So, yeah. I'm putting the pretty good episode. I liked it. Go catch Flygon. So yeah, of course you know I'm gonna try to um get these. Um again, I'm not gonna try to review every episode episode because I'm gonna be here forever if I do that. But um, the, you know there's a hardcore fans who you know while they review every episode you can easily find you know online and stuff like that. Yeah, I try to review episodes that can you know kind of peak my eye. You know everybody's gonna talk about and stuff like that. Of course, but this is a little episode. I don't know. I already know my friends are gonna talk about it a lot. So yeah. Again, though, typical stuff like that, of course, but yeah. And on to the little episode, which everybody's been probably waiting for. Of course, you know, um, you know, go, you know, cause like, is, um, uh, Executor, um, Execute, was it Execute? Yeah, of course, evolving it with, um, Executor, um, I kind of like it, though. It's weird. I'd never seen it evolve. I never knew it evolved with the Leaf Stone. What does it make sense, you know, it's a big pineapple tree. I'm picking in Alola, which makes sense to this episode. <laughs> um, yeah. Of course, it evolves into um, Executor, you know, goes happy and stuff like that, you know, added to his team with Pokedex. So, we keep going on. Then, of course, you know, um, he'll be excited, tells the professor and stuff like that. Again, you know, pretty simple stuff like that, and, you know, them going on, like, you know, um, Ash, you know, talking about, you know, he wants to go, um, go wants to go to Lola, see, um, uh, Lola and Executor. It's kind of weird, though, because, you know, Ash just left Lola, and now he's kind of back doing his thing. But, yeah, it's pretty good, though. Um, you know, I like the callback. It's so early, though, too. It's only, like, the third, so, yeah. Something episode? I don't know, I know, I know Babel goes up to, like, 51 episodes. And that's pretty much done for that. Again, I'm thinking of dinner content because I have all those videos already ready and stuff like that. You know, edited, not converted yet. And that's all I got really to do because editing doesn't take that long. It takes me like a couple of minutes because I'm like I'm only editing the beginning. Maybe if the video gets interrupted. If I know the video doesn't get interrupted, um, I'm gonna be happy. So I don't have to you know go back to extra stuff. Or you know I might like end up adding like sound effects or stupid stuff like that. Which will probably most maybe start doing in the future. Maybe if you guys like um, if support gets get free guys. I mean support's already amazing for the channel. I love it so much. Did you guys watching the video stuff fun? I get that. Um, this how it's gonna be structured and stuff like that. I might start doing that in the future, but of course, you know, Ash and Gola and Lola, you see the boy Kikui. Yeah, good memories, of course. I'm mean, Ash, you know, explains stuff like that, you know, how you make Kikui and stuff like that, you know. And yeah, I feel like Lola had a little bit more opening, building than like the other series and stuff like that. You know, Ash, uh, you know, I kind of got home, home, family from home, from home and stuff like that, you know. Father son thing, you know, big family thing. Of course, all those Pokemon stuff like that, being like Pokeballs a lot. They kind of were though a lot. Besides Pikachu, I know a lot like you know Rock Ruff and stuff like that when he had it. We had Dusk like Rock, but I still have him on Pokemon. 
or just on the Ultra Moon game, which I like that. I love it. I love using them on my team. It's really good. That's why I'm using Zero Roar, even though it's like a legendary, not a legendary, um, event Pokemon, which I never really use like that. I use Dark Rock because I love Dark Rock. Um, again, it was still one of my favorite legendaries in the series for me specifically, though. Then, you know, um, you know, Kui, um, starts to, um, you know, compliment on Go on his Pokemon and stuff like that. Um, you know, Go being good and stuff like that, so doesn't really know, you know, kind of going on and stuff like that. Then, that, you know, we see Brunette and stuff like that. Yeah, and they have a baby, of course, you know. It's like symbolizing like a big brother now, so that's kind of cool. Um, that has been like, what, maybe nine, almost ten months now, since technically, uh, because we already knew she was already pregnant in the, um, episode. The last, the very last, a little episode. We kind of already saw that already. Um, Dang, that means a lot of time was fast, or maybe you know, early or whatever. I'm not, I'm not gonna go into all that though. Then of course you know they're starting to be going somebody you know, trying to introduce themselves. Then we see all oh, that is alone Pokemon besides you know Poipo. Poipo. You know it's evolution. I can I think it's like Noitri. But I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it again. I, I, my friends probably pronounce it for me. They're gonna pronounce it for me. Of course. Yeah, that that um. But then, yeah, of course, you know, they'll start calling a ball on each other and stuff like that, of course. I like it, though. You know, we got, um, to see, like, you know, it's like little clips and stuff like that. But, yeah. Um, and it's pretty simple stuff like that, of course. Then after that, you know, action goes start to go on and stuff like that. See, so, well, Alola was beautiful, though, honestly. It was really good. I still love it. Then, of course, you know, girls start to catch more on yeah, Alola and Pokemon and stuff like that. Of course, you know, I'm getting familiar around with the areas and stuff like that. You know, going back to the first Alola episode where Ash, you know, about to catch, um, was it? What was it? It was... That Turpinch, it was, I'm thinking of something else. Grubbin? Might have been Grubbin. Because I think it was confirmed that Ash was going to get a Grubbin, but it never was, technically. So yeah, again, go, yeah, I was, was alone in Duck Trio. Um, then at that, of course, you know, um, Dango just freaking drowns. It's like, yeah, he just drowns. He's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. But of course, um, you know, kind of gets lost and stuff like that. Like how I did in the first episode, but I like that. And then I show off Marini, Mimikyu, and I want to say, um, yeah, Marini, Mimikyu, um, but where, like, all of them in, um, Snubble? Snubble? Was it Snubble? Not Snubble. And it was, like, for a ball of Snubble. It was, like, Snubble or something like that. And then they actually did show them off, like, as a cameo thing. I don't think James and Jester really saw him, because I don't think Team Rock was in this episode. So, of course, the one that finishes out go, you know, by a die and stuff like that. But, yeah, he finishes him out and stuff like that. Again, it's, like, a big callback to the little episode. So, yeah, of course. Yeah, there they are. Um, I kind of like that. Then, of course, the runs on decks, you know, finds the edge and stuff like that. Um, kind of weird to pop them out of nowhere, though. But yeah, then there's their, um, runs on phones, like, hey, you're a Pokedex. <laughs> but yeah, then, of course, you know, get yeah, on back to Pokemon School. We see all the lone squad back again. Woohoo. Yeah, of course, we got Kiawe, Malo, uh, Lana. Of course, we got everybody back, you know, the new Sword and Shield art style. Even though they don't really look that different from their lone counterpart art styles, but again, some similar thing, not some similar thing. But of course, you know, some still going to Pokemon School and stuff like that. You know, conquering your dreams, typical stuff. Of course, then they tell them to start on going, going, kind of like getting a little bit, a little bit uncomfortable. And of course, the boy Kiawe comes in, of course, and you know, saying, Oh, yeah, I was actually right, and stuff like that, because I think Go kind of the picture and stuff like that. And then, of course, now we got the plenty of fixed back encounters. Yeah, um, yeah, there, there, um, all the Pokemon start to meet each other, stuff like that, of course, you know, our boot was to try, you know, battling, um, I think it's like Go and Rabu and up versus Kiawe and, um, Terminator, because, you know, typical Pokemon. And then, you know, Ash come back and stuff like that, of course, and everybody's completely shocked and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, you know, typical stuff like that, of course. Then, you know, back to dumb typical stuff. I definitely know they had like a letter from Lily and stuff like that, you know, her going on a journey to find her father. I don't think it's this one around here. I definitely know that. Yeah, all oh, this right here. But yeah, because yeah, I see her and Gladion and stuff like that, of course. I think they went back to Ita Foundation or they're just going on a journey to find their father. But yeah, I think that was already mentioned as well, so that was pretty good though. Of course, you know, um, they'll miss each other, um, hoping to see each other one day and stuff like that. So yeah, hopefully they do though, of course. You know, that's that, um, you know, back to the typical episode thing where Ash or Go's gonna come out on Kawhi and stuff like that, of course. You know, typical stuff, you know, <laughs> typical alone and stuff. But of, of course, though, um, yeah, it was this, 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 yeah. Him, um, displaying the Z moves and stuff like that, you know, Kawhi getting serious and stuff like that, of course. You know, go, the time I'm gonna conquer my dreams, you know, them going back and forth being serious and stuff like that. Um, again, that's typical stuff like that, of course. Then they start to balance and stuff like that, you know, understand each other more and more and more. Um, I think Grabber moves go all the way and stuff like that, so, um, yeah, he wouldn't get, like, utterly obliterated, so, yeah. Um, then after that, you know, they started to acknowledge each other and stuff like that, you know, conquering the dreams and stuff like that. Typical stuff. Then after that, I think, um, they're still starting to kind of go into, um, you know, go catching moves and stuff like that. Then everybody, you know, being friends and stuff like that. Then he catches that alone as, like, a tour. Then he got all those swimming moves back. Yes, but yeah, of course, fans are I'm just joking. But yeah. It gets a low and Zeki tour and stuff like that. Then, of course, them explaining going over Lola and stuff like that. They want to go back one day. And yeah, and the episode's pretty good. Both episodes, the last episodes, are pretty good. Again, back to back and stuff like that. Yeah, we go catching the flag on. And of course, you know, this happening as well. But again, though, pretty simple stuff. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Like I said, it was, really wasn't going to try to make these out long. But yeah, pretty good stuff, though, of course. I do like this time around. Pretty calm, pretty peaceful. I like it, though. I'm going to get lots of couple episodes. Really good. I think everybody's alone in life and stuff like that. Hopefully, we'll see them more in the future and they'll come back season for the um, everybody. You know, we got hashtag alone squad in the comments. 
comments and stuff like that. I'd be honest, I usually, I wasn't usually doing this yet. See you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great. Oh, good job. You know, hope you guys enjoyed it. What do you guys think? I loved it as well. Both episodes were really, were really amazing. Um, for actually go prospectively, think of buying bikes to, you know, guide them going to do anything. Yeah. See you guys later though. Again though. Peace out.